In August 2020, Nigeria was declared wild polio virus free due to the tremendous efforts of Nigerian government and development partners, including eHealth Africa. Despite the elimination of the wild polio virus, the circulating variant poliovirus type 2 transmission persists. In response to this public health challenge, eHealth Africa is implementing the Geospatial Tracking System Project, GTS, a two-part initiative aimed at supporting polio immunization efforts nationwide. My day starts from 5 a.m. I have a bike person that picks me. Coming down to the LG, I bring out my trackers. I bring out my walking tools. These are the trackers that I've been working with since the beginning of the exercise. I have 100 teams in this LG. By 6 a.m., it start picking track. By then, the work for car persons would have been around. So, so what? You have so, so number of phones, then I give it to you, you sign, then you go with it. It helps to know whether the teams go each and every place to vaccinate children or not. Then I came to Kamana, Wajan, Mazak, Aloyara, when the bus was in the Dali ne riki wannan tiraka ne dan ya a san mun yi aiki muna shiga gida gida muna kiran yara muna kawo su ana yi musu allura da zaka yi with this we know our longitude and we know our latitude and this will help us to know the actual name of the rural settlement we know our status of implementation we know where the gap is we know where we are heading for the map of after the implementation date. These are all the settlements in that particular ward. Anyone that is missed is usually red, and the ones that are rich are usually green. We can also check the activities of the teams. This is how you know the teams are actually moving from house to house, from settlement to settlement. It's from this dashboard we download our data for analysis to give reports on the activity in all the campaigns. As of today, Sokoto North is on 99%. They are number one in Sokoto states. So Every LGA that we are tracking, we have one person responsible for that particular LGA who gives back feedback to the LGA yeah. team. I think this is a very good result. Please keep it up. Thank you very much. And then we at the state level here, I give feedback to the state and partners. You see this is delivered. With this, we are sure of all nooks and crannies of Sokoto, all the country you are actually visiting. Some of the successes already recorded includes the tracking of over 20,000 vaccination teams across five polio campaigns across 10 states including states in what has now been coined as the axis of intractable transmission. These states include Katsina, Kebi, Sokoto and Zamfara states, states with many security compromise areas restricting the access to the millions of vaccine eligible children in these locations. In addition, the settlement lists of six key states, namely Kaduna, Katsina, Kebi, Niger, Sokoto, and Zamfara states have also been updated to ensure that all the settlements are geocoded, facilitating the tracking of vaccination activities in these settlements, thereby improving vaccination coverage and boosting the immunization coverage of the country. So far, over 90% of the settlements in each state's list now has geocoordinates. I'm looking at come a day where when person said I'm going to so 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 village which is X kilometer from the main town he will go there unsupervised this is the societal orientation that I'm looking forward but technology wise I'm looking into having 
a device that is as small as possible, which has a temperature monitoring component that is actually a tracking device that our team can carry it to all the nooks and crannies without uh, being endangered by bandits feeling that they are spying on them. As the geospatial tracking system project continues to chart its course through the terrains of Nigeria, it carries with it the promise of a nation where no child has to face the threat of the circulating variant polio type 2 virus. It is a testament to the power of innovation, the strength of the human resolve, and the unyielding belief that we can and we will usher in a healthier future for all. One vaccination, one child, one geo-coordinate at a time.